Hey guys, Strike here, and welcome to Five Nights at Venture and Tales 2. Now, it has been months since I played the first game of this game series, where there's only two. Now, I'm actually playing this game right now because I'm using this as a coping mechanism because I keep throwing speedruns in Five Nights at Treasure Island. I'm trying to do a speedrun on night one to six, but my mind drifts away because of how boring it is. It's 40, 40 minutes of just easy levels. And yeah, I can mess up. And the thing that happened though is I was on a good run and I was at Pirate's Cavern 2 in the elevator going up to full three. And I got a blue screen. I blue screened the recording corrupted. So I, I'm playing this as a cope anyway. So yeah, we got night one. The absolute basics. Keep the intruder out. Interesting. Tutorial? Yeah. Uh, sure. Let's see what's going on in this game. Okay, click on a doorway to pass through it. Oh, that's locked. Well, that's a big mouse button. Oh, hold it down to close areas like this one and block out enemies. Interesting. How do I know when they're gone? In order to leave, click the arrow below or press down to the WASD, which would be... Oh, so I can... Oh, we can move around like that, alright. Survive until 6am. Ah, okay. So, if we get to the point, we can start trying to move around really quickly if we want. Oh, he was there. Okay, he's still there. Okay, he's gone. So, is there any way for me to, like, me to know where they are? I guess not, they just kind of appear. So it seems like this tutorial, yeah, it's already 3 a.m. Yeah, this tutorial net is very short. Oh, hey, Isaac Fry. Oh, you're already gone. Isaac Fry. Goodbye, Isaac Fry. Get out of here, Isaac Fry. You're not getting into your own house. Screw you. Who are we playing as? I don't even think it was determined who we're playing as in the first game, I mean. How are we supposed to know? I mean, I, I guess we're, we're just someone. Okay, there we go. You survived. You survived. Whoa. Was that night one or was that a tutorial? I have to check just in case. Oh, okay. Same thing, all right. Whoopsie daisies, I guess we're playing night one twice in a row. That's fine. We'll just have to get through this then. Also, it doesn't... It just seems we don't have to click on the actual area to close it as well. We just have to be in... In the... In the room. When closing it. So how is this going to go? And whose house is this? Because it, it looks really good. Like, is, is it theirs? I don't know. I know that there was a lot of drama that happened between the, the women and men in the family. Like, a lot of bad stuff. And so they're just separated. But was this originally their house that they recorded videos in? I don't know. But yeah, there we go. We survived again. Okay, let's go on to night two because... We already played night one, so let's move on to night two and see what's going on. Explore the entirety of the second floor. Check all rooms for intruders. Doorways that glow red when hovered over indicate an enemy is trying to break in. Oh, okay. So that's how we know. Okay, so there is a red glow that happens. Okay. So we can go through the whole second floor. All right. Well, get me out of here. Balcony, Sierra's room, Isaac's room, uh, Bethany's room, okay, okay, we can't go down yet, oh gosh, Isaac's room, okay, Go. okay, so the, it, it, it must be their house then, because I mean, it's their rooms, okay, wait, oh, I can also go here, alright, I didn't know that, okay, uh, balcony, Turn around, Isaac's room. Get rid of you. Okay. 
No. Uh, oh, Sierra's room. Oh. Uh, okay. Okay. We're good. Oh, no, 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 no. Get away. Okay, good. Uh, we're going to have to really try to remember this. All right. Uh, yep, there you are. What are you all doing in your, what, your attic? What, what are you doing? Okay, uh, got rid of him? Okay, good. Okay, uh, so we can't go down here yet, and we haven't encountered Venturian yet, so by process of elimination, I'm going to assume Venturian is going to be on the bottom floor, but where? I don't know. But we'll keep going. Oh, Bethany, get out of here. So what happens if they get in? Can they get in? I don't know. Oh, obviously. What, what do I expect? Of course they can get in. That's why I'm keeping them away. Jeez. It's only night two, by the way. Remember that. Oh, this is going to be one of those maps that are going to be really difficult to remember. I'm pretty sure Venturian is had played this game. But obviously he would be really good at it because he know he knows it. He's lives it in the map. <laughs> but yeah, there we go. That's night two. Oh wow, that's only six minutes long. Should I just play through the entire game? I guess I will. Because I mean it's only been six minutes. Entire lower floor unlocked. New enemies look at it in the office on the first floor. Enemies will now roam the house when they get in. You have a chance to win as long as you run. Interesting. Okay. So now we get the lower floor, which is probably where Venturian is. And we're going to keep them away. All right. Sounds good. Okay. So camp out here. Office. Oh. Living room. Okay. Oh, shit. Okay. Whoops. Oh, shoot. That's not good. She's already out. How bad is that? Oh, shoot. Oh, Bethany's not out yet. Oh, wait. Wait. Where am I? Where am I going? Oh, oh. Oh, shoot. Oh, he's out. Great. Oh, great. Oh, now Bethany's out. Fuck. <laughs> oh, where am I? I don't, uh, where, I, I don't know where I've gone. Where am I? <laughs> where, where have I gone? Okay, they're all locked. That is not good. Oh, God. Where the fuck am I? <laughs> <laughs> Where am I? Okay, we've got some cars, I guess. Um, it's really quiet right now. I like it. It's very chilly. Oh, hey, hey. Um, okay. Okay, the garage is fine again. Oh, no. No, it's not. Wait, fuck. I don't know where it went that time, but it worked. Okay, how about we go uh, all the way back to Isaac's room. They're all out, so we can't keep them back. <laughs> fuck. Um, okay. It's a bit quiet, which is good. It's a good sign. Because it means I'm not getting chased. Which is for the best. Okay. Okay, the boom. No. Okay. So we're, we're safe here for now, okay. So we'll just wait here. Okay, so we can look between those. Okay, uh, living room. Sunroom. Living room. Oh, some room. Oh, kitchen. Go into the garage then. Okay. I don't know where I'm going, but... 
We're not dead, so that that's something. Like, I'm trying to imagine, like, in reality, like this. You're just running past these guys and they're trying to kill you. And there's four of them. And you're just running around that their own house. It's their own house. Yet, where the imposters walk the sussies? I don't know. Like, we are the ones that are not in trouble? Or what? Like, everything is labeled after them. Um, okay. Laundry room, hallway, fuck. Uh, I don't know where I'm going. I am completely lost. I don't know how this, how the rooms navigate, but I'm get, I guess I'm getting lucky to not die. <laughs> I'm trying to understand this, but I don't. Cause like, this sunroom, cool. Uh, oh, I can turn around to the left here. I didn't realize. Oh, and this leads me here, okay. Ah, so that's why I was getting so confused, okay. Okay, what's the AM? I wanna remove the recording thing. Okay, 5 AM, all right. So now I can see it because I moved it, which is good. So the night should end soon, so that's good. There we go. Night three, complete. Okay. Well, yeah, that's pretty cool. Uh, entire outdoors unlocked. Same concept as last time, only much faster. Run for your life. Hold right click to charge the number on the bottom left of your screen. If that number reaches zero, it will be game over. You cannot move while recharging. Okay, that, that sounds difficult, so I, I know it's pretty early, but I'm guessing night five is going to be something else. So, since night five is probably going to be a really difficult one, I think I, actually I will end the episode here. I was thinking of just playing through the whole game in this video, but never mind, because night four already sounds difficult. But in night five, it's going to be even more difficult. So, hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, stick around for more Five Nights of Adventure and Tale 2. And I'll see you guys next time. Goodbye.